Hey guys, Bodie here. Today we have a call to a PCH scammer who didn't like it when I called him out for being Jamaican. Let's get into it. Good man from the Publishers Clearing House. How are you doing today, madam? Uh, oh yes, I'm, I'm doing uh, great. How are you? Okay. Yes, I'm wonderful. Thanks for hacking as well. I can see that you contacted our department today. Did you spoke to anyone? Uh, I didn't, no. I didn't speak oh, to anybody. Did not. Oh, no. okay then. And did they leave you with a price number or a claim number, something like that? No. No, was, there, was I supposed to have a number? Okay, when they call you the first time and they leave you the, the message. the message. It, it didn't, it got cut off. It, it like started, I don't know. It didn't, I didn't get the whole message. Okay then, no worries then. Just hold on the line, let me find your file, okay? It might have said it. Uh, maybe if I could check it again, maybe I, I, I didn't hear it or something. Okay, hold on, let me see. Should, I hang, should I hang up and, and call it and see? Okay, hold on, wait first. Right. Yes, and what is your first and your last name? It's Eileen, last name Ulick, U-L-I-C-H. Okay, Miss Ulick, hold on. And this is your home phone number you calling on, right? Or this is your cell phone? Uh, this is my, my home phone. Okay, this is... And do you have a cell number as well? No, no. Okay, then. That's okay. Because we see that your information have been randomly selected here at the Publishers Clearing House, so that is the reason why you have received a call from our organization to inform you that yeah. you are this month's lucky winner here at the Publishers Clearing House. Yeah. So when I check your information yeah. here, it showed that you have registered with our company for over 30 years. Oh, my goodness, And you yes. have not, you yes, have I, never I've won not, anything. I've, I know, I've never won anything. So I've been right. doing this for, for so long. I've gotten, I used all the time I would get Reader's Digest. Sometimes I was the only reason I'd get it. <laughs> but I, I loved all the other that. things in the Reader's Digest, like the, uh, what was it, the uh, Life's Like That, that little one with little an anecdotes and the uh, college humor. Uh, what are the other ones? There's a couple of them that are in there that people would write in. <laughs> Those were the best stories. I'd... And then I'd be flipping through and I'd get the little pamphlet for the publisher's clearinghouse. I did that for years. I mean, they stopped putting them in, though. Right, I can see I... that you have, you have stopped because as I explained mm -hmm. to you that you... We see that you have been playing this game for over 30 years and you have never won anything no, before. No, I haven't. No, you're right. So you have finally won now. So you're supposed to be happy well, and I rejoicing. Am, I am. Oh, my. I, I, earlier, I was... I, I was... <laughs> I was going on on the uh, onto the internet on and looking up uh, different things to, <laughs> to spend my money on. Oh my goodness! Okay, okay. I and already have a was... lot of it already spent in my head. Like I have have uh, you know certain given away to certain people and to help them out and, and whatnot, and I get different a couple of charities and then uh, uh, securing my my yeah. own uh, finances and my and, uh, situation and everything of course but right. i mean so i do don't need that yourself? much when i i'm i'm 73 years old i really don't need all that but goodness gracious i know i can make other people's lives a lot better that's for sure I mean, I don't need it myself, but right. other people certainly do need it. That is right. So you live by yourself? Yes, I live. Yes, I live alone. Ever since my my husband oh, died. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. Yes. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's all right. He, he left that. a he left a sizable in, uh, uh, life insurance. So. <laughs> and he was no, uh, okay, he was he was a, a little bit of an asshole. God rest his soul. <laughs> okay then. Okay then. That's beautiful. But I need you to get a pen and a paper so I can give you all the necessary information, okay? The what? You want to go where? Yes, I want you to get a pen and a paper so I can give you all oh, the necessary yes, yeah. information. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. All right. <laughs> all right. Okay, now, so my name is Mark Goodman, and that is M-A-R-K. M. A R K Goodman G O Goodman. D M A N. That is correct. And my phone number is nine one seven. Nine one seven. Nine four six. Nine four six. Five one. Five one. Nine four six. No, that's huh? no. Let me go back over. I make a mistake. I'm sorry. That's nine one seven nine four six one one five one. One one five one. That is correct. Oh oh oh. 
Oh. And my badge number is 2811. Yeah, your what? My badge number. Your badge number? What, what, are you law enforcement? No, remember, I have to have a badge number because I'm your claim agent here. So I'm the general manager here at the publisher's clearing house. I'm a manager here, so I have a badge number. Well, usually badges are for law enforcement. <laughs> That's so strange. Okay, well, what is it? No, that is the number to identify me. That's a badge number. That's well, my that would be an employee number, number not a badge number. But yes, anyway, it's a badge what is it? Number. It's well, as I said, a badge is for law enforcement. That's what a badge is, not... That's right, right, yeah, right. Okay, so what is it? It's 2811. 2811. One, one, that one, is correct. Right. Okay, now, so I'm your claim agent, so I need to walk you through the process so you can understand what you're supposed to do and so you can understand when this presentation will actually be making out to your home again. <gasps> All right? <sighs> Yeah. Yep. So first thing, do you want this to publicize on national television or do you want this to be done as a private presentation? Yeah, I would like it uh, just like all the other all the other ones. I've always seen them on the TV. <laughs> oh my goodness, come and knock at your door and, and, and uh, uh, surprise you. But well, I mean, uh, the surprise is kind of kind of gone now. But uh, yeah, no, I, I would well, want it uh, certainly public. So. Oh, so you want this? You no, sure you want this to minute. go? For, uh, listen, wait a minute. Listen. You wait, need to listen for wait, a second. Wait. Okay, go ahead. Uh, um, the, uh, I don't know. How does, so does everybody, uh, has everybody always faked it or something? I don't understand. Right. They always faked it, sweetheart. All right. We have to call them and let them know and they go through this process that you're going through now. That was all fake. And oh my God. Wow. You have to remember, we have to make you remember, we can't just come to a random person door and just give them millions of dollars and we don't know if you're the rightful person. So. That's, um, that's a little bit disingenuous, but uh, okay. I mean, there's so many things in life are faked, I guess. Okay, so you say you want it to be public, right? So you want to go yes, on national yeah. television? Well, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay then. And what color car would you like? Because we normally gave out white, okay, black, well. and silver. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Uh, black? Uh, Are you okay? Yes, I'm sorry. What's wrong with you? Oh, I'm sorry. I just, I had the beans for, for lunch. Uh, you know, they're, they're the magical uh, fruit, right? The more right. you eat, the more you... Uh, toot. Uh. Oh. So, hello? Yes, I'm still here. Yes, I, I'm sorry. Did I offend you? With... Hear you? Uh, That's okay. I don't, well, I don't I know if you've ever you. spent any time around uh, any senior citizens, but uh, well, I mean, I, I can't be embarrassed about that kind of stuff anymore. <laughs> I feel oh, it. I'm gonna. I'm gonna let it go. Gotta let it go. You can't let. You can't uh, bottle that up inside, especially at, at at my age. So what you're saying that you want to cancel your price? What do you What do you mean? I'm just saying that a little bit. Of, uh, is no. I, I don't want to cancel my price. Of course not. Oh, well, I thought what you were talking about. I don't understand what you were talking about. Well, you're getting upset because I'm I'm, I'm, I'm flatulating a little bit. No, I'm not getting upset. I'm laughing. Oh, okay. Everyone does that. But you're a senior citizen. I do understand that you have to fluctuate. So I understand that. So I did ask you what color car you say you want, and you say black. A black, yes. Yeah. Right. And do you want this to publicize on national television, or do you want this to be done as a private present? No, do you want this? I asked you already. You have to yes. make sure. They ask the question two times. Do you want oh. this to publicize, oh, or yeah. do you want it to be because you are a senior citizen and you know once you go on national television the whole world will be seeing that, you that, and wasn't you, a lot of that wasn't you messing up and asking the same question twice you have to ask it twice right right <laughs> good cover so you still <laughs> want it to be public <laughs> Yes, yeah, it's public okay then. and what was your occupation before you retired? I worked at the bank. I was a teller. So you were a teller? Yeah. Oh, okay. For how many years? Uh, for about 22 years. Okay, it was about 1980 years. I started. Oh, yeah. Okay. Uh, yeah, about 22, 23 years. 
Yeah. So so if you're so and are you still able to drive? Oh yes, yeah. Okay. Okay then, because this is what you're going to have to do now, all right? Because once you are a winner here, you have to register your information to the lottery game. I still office. can't get over that they faked it all this time. I've seen so many people win, and every one of those were fake. Oh, Pardon? Goodness. I just I can't get over that all of these people faked winning all the time. I've seen for years and years on TV with people. Uh, them come into the doors and they'll open it and they just jump up and down like they it was the first time they ever heard of it it was all fake no it's gonna be happy you're gonna be happy sweetheart because when yes you but they the they the... you don't understand what i'm saying they they faked being surprised that they won yes but they do one they they did one but still it's not you're not understanding what i'm saying i'm saying they faked being surprised they faked the whole right. we're gonna come and surprise you at your door there's no surprising at anybody's door that it's all right. it's all a show that's that is horrible it's horrible that's it's it's it, 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 it's false uh false advertising right it's all it's all for advertising that's why they hack you no it's you false want advertising that's not a good thing false advertising is illegal oh no, it's not illegal yes it is Yes, it is. What do you mean it's not illegal? If you if you We're advertise something, it has to be real. It can't be fake. No, just like when the movies. The movies are fake. So the, that's the movies. Thing. No, not for advertisement. Is not like the movies. Where, what world do you come from? You obviously don't live in America. Yes, you have I no know. idea what the first world is like, do you? What you're talking about? What am I talking about? What the hell are you talking about? You don't know what the hell is going on in this world. Of course I know what's going on in this world. So why are you behaving like this, no one? Because you're trying... What did I do to what? you? What? Wow. What did I do to you? Your English is just spot on. I'm not hungry at you, sweetheart. You're not hungry right? with me? You're not hungry with me? I'm not, not hungry with you. You're not hangry either? No, I'm not hungry with you. <laughs> My goodness gracious. You're something else. You're just something else, aren't you? You really and think... Why do you say that? You really think that you, you, you can uh, pull this off, hmm? You really think. Do you think you're cut out for this? Do you really think you're cut out for this? Doesn't seem like it. I think you need to get a, a, a different job. You're not cut out for it. What different? Mark, you're not cut out for what it. Di what different job, sweetheart? You are the winner here. You, you need to go go sell here. some coconuts or something. I don't know. Find something. Because you're not you're doing you're not doing this job well. That's for sure. And why you're saying that? Uh, well, one, you don't know English properly because, well, because you, you, I mean, you're not English. You don't speak English, so that's that's natural, I guess. But well, what? Two, you have you don't even have any idea what the hell is going on here here in America. You don't even know what advertisements are or how they they run. Everybody knows that you can't false advertise. That it's illegal. Yeah. It's not like the movies. That's not a thing. Maybe down in Jamaica, it's a thing like that. But not here, dear. Not here. Okay, get a little bit. Uh, get get a little bit uh, more uh, knowledge about our culture before you try to uh, call here and faking to be American. But I'm American. What are you're you not, talking God, about? You're not. God. You're not. You are not American. You're Jamaican. And how you know I'm a Jamaican? Because I've spent time in Jamaica and I know how the people talk there, and I know how they talk when they try to uh, speak like uh, uh, an American. No, I'm not Jamaican, so I don't know what uh, you're trying to do. No, you know, not a Jamaican. Uh, hmm? Well, there it is, folks. Hope you enjoyed. If you did, hit the like button, comment down below, and subscribe if you have not already. Then hit the bell and share. And until the next one, vote out. You have been by Oda.